Okay, folks, I showed you a while back uh, my new laser engraver, and uh, I showed you some cutting boards um, that I could do with it. I want to show you what I can do with some uh, three millimeter acrylic now. It will engrave on the acrylic, and I can also use vector mode to cut out designs. So I'm loading the uh, raster image now and it's going to engrave. It'll be hard to see it first. The uh, idea behind this is to engrave lightly on the clear acrylic and then cut out the pattern around it and then you can mount this in a little stand that has LED lights in the bottom of it and whatever's engraved illuminates. It looks kind of similar to those neon looking uh, menu boards that they have when you write on them. It looks like the letters glow. It's very similar to that. But I want to show you how we can raster engrave. Uh, I could vector engrave around the raster to make a nice sharp edge around each of the letters and vector cut all in the same program, all in the same file using three different colors similar to the way my ULS 25 laser worked and uh, but this thing does just fine it'll take just a minute to uh, etch the Bravo technologies and then the website techbravo.net underneath it and then I'm going to cut that out and I want to show you the end result because it looks really good I can do dog tags um, keychains cake toppers Whatever you can think of, mini boards, small stuff uh, in this in this laser, and um, I can also do anodized metals uh, like the dog tags and things like that. Zippo lighters. Uh, I do have some marking compound. I'm going to try doing some stainless steel knife blades, flasks, um, uncoated stainless steel steel that's not anodized or aluminum or brass or or whatnot. So I do have some marking compound. I'll do that a little later. But uh, I'm still doing cutting boards and I'm going to perfect this process and I'll have all kinds of neat things for birthday gifts, Christmas gifts, uh, make little plaques for your employees, employee of the month, that kind of thing. So it's almost done with the raster portion engraving the text and graphics it can be pictures it can be anything and as soon as that gets done I'm gonna send the vector cut to it and this is the cool part if I tried to cut this by hand it would look terrible but using this 30 watt laser as long as it's focused well which it is the precision and accuracy and smoothness of that cut is unbelievable. It'll just fall right out of there when it's done. So this is a pretty neat thing. The sky's the limit. Uh, whatever you can imagine, as long as it'll fit on that bed right there, I can probably do it. Well, it didn't fall out. There we go. there's the finished product that's so smooth and then you put a laser uh, LEDs behind it and it will actually make the uh, engraving glow that wasn't a very good example but uh, that's some pretty neat stuff more to come stay tuned from the shed quarters of Bravo Technologies check out our website www.techbravo.net see you later